Hello, I am Mr. Adams, and I am a music teacher in Hastings, Nebraska. This is going to be a video for second grade music class uh, during the second week that we haven't been having school. We're going to be working on a different goal than our kindergarten first grade, because it's going to be a little bit uh, harder. It's going to be a step up. I will be able to read and dictate second grade rhythms. Now, what that means dictation is being able to draw and write down the rhythms that happen in the song. Now, there will be some materials for second grade. If you have a pencil and a paper, that should be enough. Now, the activities are Go, Go, Go. Um, it's a pretty popular song that second grade did at the beginning of the year. Uh, we're gonna be doing our easy second grade rhythm cards, so no twos yet. And then Draw a Bucket of Water. Um, to draw a bucket of water, I have a big book and some visuals, and we have done this as a dance before. If you want to do the dance with your family, I'll even show you how to do it. You will probably need at least three people to do it. Maybe more would be good, but we could probably make it work with three. All right, the first song is Go, 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 and I have drawn all the words on the board. And our goal for this is to be able to draw some simple uh, rhythms uh, from the song. So it goes, one for the money, two for the show, three to get ready now, go, go, go. Now, I'm going to make this a little bit easier. There are a couple of rests in this song that sounds. So it's one for the money, rest. Two for the show, rest. Three to, excuse me, three to get ready now. Three to get ready now. No rest. Go, go, go. Now that we've got that out of the way, we're going to be doing rhythmic dictations for the rest of it. The, the rests are particularly challenging on that one, so I thought I'd give that one to you. So what we're going to do is we're going to clap. We're just going to see if we can find where the fast or slow sounds are. Remember, slow sounds are going to be our ta. Our faster sounds are going to be tt. And the tts always have two sounds to go with them. We're going to clap and sing the song. One for the money. Two for the show. Three to get ready now. Go, go, go. All right, let's break it down just one line at a time. One for the money. How many sounds are there? One for the money. One for the money. One for the money. Okay, there are five sounds. One of the sounds is slower than the others. One for the money. One for the money. Hmm, which one is it? Which one is it? Oh, it's one. Nah, I cheated. Told you. One. If that's the slow sound, where are the others? One for the money. One for the money. Should be for the is a T. And money has two parts and is also T T. Ta T T T. Two for the show. Two for the show. Two for the show. This one is a little bit tricky. There's how many sounds? Two for the show. There's four sounds. Now, here's a hint. Two of these have a slow sound. Two for the show. Two for the show. The first ta is really easy to find, I think. It's that one. The second one is a little bit harder. It's where is the fast sounds? Two for the show. Two for the show. For the seems fast. Because it is. So, if you're drawing this so far, 
you should have ta, t, t, excuse me, ta, t, 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 t. One for the money, ta, t, 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 rest, ta, t, t, ta, rest. The three to get ready now. No rest. So this is the probably the trickiest one, I think. Three to get ready now. Three to get ready now. Three to get ready now. Where's the fast sound? Three to get ready now. If you saw if you said the, the fast sound was in a couple different places, you'd probably be right. Three, two, ready. Oops. Three to get ready now. If they're not fast sounds and there's no rest, there's there's only a ta left. There's only a quarter note to put in there. Now let's see if you can figure out the ending. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Are those fast sounds or slow sounds? Go, go, go. Let's do the whole song see if you can figure it out. One for the money. Two for the show. Three to get ready now. Go, go, go. Yeah, they're slow sounds. So we have these two different sounds over here. The ta is slow and the t is a little bit faster. So this should be ta, ta. How fancy are you? Did you get that whole thing done? Let's try clapping and saying what we've got so far. Ta, t, 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 t. Ta, t, t, ta. T, t, ta. T, t, ta. Ta, ta, ta. One for the money. Two for the show. Three ticket. Ready now, go, go, go. Now, we sang this song and we used it on uh, xylophones and barred instruments. Um, and I'm going to play a little bit on the piano because I, I think people are wanting to uh, probably sing this. There is an A part and a B part. This is the A part. This is the part that um, we all played on instruments. One for the money. Two for the show, three to get ready now, go, go, go. One for the money, two for the show, three to get ready now, go, go, go. And then we had a switching part, which goes like this. I said go, I said go, I said go, I said go, 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 go. I said go, I said go, I said go, go, go. So that was... A and B. And second graders, um, this is not a goal, but we should be able to know our patterns. So I'm going to play it on the piano. You won't be able to see me. to um, have drawn most of this. This is, this is a pretty challenging first try goal to see if people can draw and um, do that rhythm correctly. But our second graders should be able to do this by the start of the fourth quarter. All right, now some simple uh, second grade rhythm cards. These second grade rhythm cards, there are no twos, so don't even try it. I also took out all of the, the second grade uh, half rests. So we don't have any of those either. I threw in some first grade rhythm cards in there to make it less boring. All right, let's clap and say these rhythms. One, two, here we go. Ta, 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 ta. 
Now, if you clap it, it'll make it easier to do correctly. So I hope you're clapping it. All right, straight into some hard ones. One, two, here we go. T, 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 T. Oh, do you even remember what that is? Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, oh. Uh. That's still T, T. It's just separated now. It's still T. Y'all know that. All right. One, two, here you go. Ta, ta, ti, ti, ta. One, two, here we go. Ta, ta. Oop. One, two, here we go. Ta, ta. Oh, there's that again. One, two, here we go. T, T, ta, T, T, ta. All right, that's a first grade rhythm. It's harder, isn't it? Mm -hmm. One, two, here we go. T, 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 ta. Did you clap it correctly? I hope so. I'm going to assume you did because I didn't hear you make a mistake. One, two, here we go. T, T, ta, T, T, ta. That's backwards. One, two, here we go. Ta, T, T, ta. Ta. One, two, here we go. Ta, ti, 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 ta. One, two, here we go. Ti, ti, ta, ta, ta. Are you able to keep up? One, two, here we go. Ti, 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 ta. Now we're back to the beginning. We just did all of them. I hope you got them all right. You should have. You're in second grade. Those are possible for you. All right. All right. Our third activity is going to be a song called Draw a Bucket of Water. We're going to try to find the half notes or the twos. Now, the two is open. There's no filling it in. So when you were doing your rhythm drawing the last one, I hope that the, they were filled in all the way because if they were open, that's, that's a different note. All right, so draw, here we go. Draw a bucket of water for my only daughter. One baboon and a silver spoon. Let this old lady under. Now I'm going to give you a hint. There should be six of those that are called half notes. Those are called half notes. There were two of the ta's that they're double the length. Now, what's going to happen is we're going to try to find the slowest sounds. We're going to try to clap the rhythm of the song. Draw a bucket of water for my only daughter. One baboon and a silver spoon. Let this old lady under. All right, we're going to try just one line at a time. Draw a bucket. Here we go. Draw a bucket of water. Try it. Draw a bucket of water. Where was it slow? Draw a bucket of water. 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 Oh, oh, I'm gonna write that down. You don't have to, but I'm gonna. Water. Water has two different sounds in it. Water. Where does the half note go? It can't go like in the middle because there's two sounds. Let's see what, which, which. Let's see what side it belongs on. Draw a bucket of water. Wa sounds like yeah for sure. What about per then? What's per? Draw a bucket of water. Oh snap! It's both. Sha. It's got two of them. We found two of them. There's four left. 
Let's try the first line and add the second line into it. Draw a bucket of water for my only daughter. I just gave you the answer. I hope you figured it out. So, daughter. So there's, again, two parts on daughter, and it goes under the both of them. Daughter. All right, let's try the first line, second line, and third line. Draw a bucket of water for my only daughter. One baboon and a silver spoon. One baboon and a silver spoon. Daughter, silver spoon. Daughter, silver spoon. Yeah, these rhythms don't sound the same. Hmm. Is there any half note or two in that? One baboon and a silver spoon. No. There, there's not. One baboon and a silver spoon. Nope, there isn't. Let's see if there's one in the last line. The whole song. Draw a bucket of water for my only daughter. One baboon and a silver spoon. Let this old lady under. Let this old lady under. Yeah, it's a pattern. They happen at the end again. So it's on under. Under. We found all six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Remember, it's on each of uh, each of those parts. All right, I'm not gonna play anymore. I'm just gonna clap the half note or the two with you. Draw a bucket of water for my only daughter. One baboon and a silver spoon. Let this old lady under. Did you do it? I hope so. So, um, I usually play it on ukulele. You need to be in something called a long way set. You need to have, I mean, you could do this with two people, but it's not as exciting. Four people would be optimum. You could do it with three. A long way set is where you have two rows of people and they look towards each other. And what happens is a lot of this song, you're just facing your partner and doing the steady beat back and forth. And then on the word, let this old lady under, you make a roof and everybody goes underneath of it. Excuse me, uh, not everybody. When you make a roof, the, the people at the very end, they get to go underneath, right? Like this. It's gonna be hard to show you by myself. So it goes, draw a butt. Get a water for my only daughter. And if you can, you'd go like this on your lap by yourself. One baboon, and then you on your partner to go with a high ten and a silver spoon without destroying them. Destroying them is bad. So one baboon and a silver spoon. And then you keep your hands up here. Let this old lady under. And then the people that are at the end would go, and they go underneath. That's why it's nice to have at least three people, because then you have at least two people um, making the roof, and then one person would go underneath. And then when you say, please slide down, what happens is um, the people on the end would rotate all the way back to the beginning. And if you have three people, only one person would rotate. If you have four people, then... Then, then you can actually do the whole thing and rotate. Rotation is not a problem. All right, if you want to try it. Draw a bucket of water for my only daughter. One baboon and a 
silver spoon left this old lady under. Then the B part goes like this. Please slide down, which means rotate. Please slide down, and here we go. Draw a bucket of water for my only daughter. One baboon and a silver spoon left this old lady under. Please slide down. That means switch. This is the B section. And here we go. Draw a bucket of water for my only daughter. One baboon and a silver spoon. Let this old lady under. Yay, I did it all by myself. All right. Did we successfully draw second grade rhythms and read them? I'm going to assume yes. Your parents can grade you. They can let me know how, how it went in the comments and whether or not things happened. Yeah, you can do that. You can add comments. And please know, family uh, friendly only, so that way we can keep it published up on the screen and I can allow comments. Otherwise, parents at Longfellow, you can send me a message through email if you have any questions or concerns, or if you want more videos. Yay.